He is the Dutch national champion. Experience is very firmly in the corner of wise grip Andy Barker. Multiple world championship number two. He's 34 years of age, the taller man at 6'2 from the freak shop, Lancashire, England. I'm uh, Maynard Nengis from uh, Holland. Okay, I'm Andy Barker from Great Britain. Uh, I'm here today in the Trafford Centre to wrestle Maynard Nengis. Never seen him in person, uh, not seen much video of him, but uh, I believe he's very strong in the hook. I believe he's got a great tricep press on him. I've been training the last couple of weeks to, uh, to try to uh, stay uh, compact, so I can hold everything down. And I think uh, that's my main weapon. Yeah, he, the speed uh, that I've heard that he's, that he's got, he can initiate very fast, move you off your, uh, your bone line very quick. If he has uh, a proper grip with his fingers, he can, uh, he, can, uh, he can pull me open. And that's the only thing I'm concerned about. It's the thing from the Netherlands. Maynard Nentjes takes the stage here in Manchester, the Trafford Centre, welcoming the Dutchman for the first time. The local boy is Andy Barker, one of the flagship arm wrestlers of Team Great Britain. Barker is a beast, multiple world championship silver medalist, reigning and defending British national champion. Barker with the long dark hair, Covering one eye. Go! Winner. He will. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What a hit from Maynard Nenjes. And what a way to start. Look at that on the replay. That shoulder crunch move on the shoulder. Look at that. In with the tricep. Drive down. And Andy Barker caught napping there. Maybe underestimated the power of this young Dutchman. But you can see the determination, the tenacity, and the fire in the eyes of Maynard Nentjes. Marker looks to the crowd. Advice from his teammates. And he will soak that up like a sponge. Very modest with his own capabilities coming into this match. He uh, is aware he's been off the table for a little while. He knows little about this opponent, but he has a bag full of tricks. And he expects that he will. Whoa, elbow foul. elbow foul, surely, yeah, it is for Maynard Nentjes. Referee Keith Taylor is the man in the stripes, and he signals that straight away. But a good sign there on that bump from Andy Barker. He was gaining control and finding that signature top row reversal. Oh, big hit again from Nentjes. We slip and go into the straps. Barker not as convincing there with his hand control, but. The straps okay. are usually there, kind to Barker. He's a powerful the, top roller. He's got the long there, levers and there. great hand and control. <laughs> Big hit from Wise Grip Andy Barker. And the Englishman settles now into his pull. He will begin to bounce, and there it goes. Winner. Bumping, crashing into the wrist of Maynard Nenges. Barker levels the score. Let's look at that on the replay right off the start. Gained hand control, then just hanging on, but he was on the defensive. And Barker went to work with the vicious bumps to the side. More really to do damage, lasting damage in this six round Hopefully match. There's always a weakness. There is always a weakness. And Andy Barker, yeah. a cerebral approach to the match, finds it and begins to go on his own offensive against this young Dutch athlete. His brother, Hendrik. Nentjes working in his corner there and a little uh, bit of advice on how to deal with this rangy Englishman. 6'2", long lever athlete, Andy Barker. Huge hands and an excellent technical range. Go! competing at world level since 1998. And he has racked up a lot of very impressive victories. He's found that top roll, but Nentjes is dug in with his shoulder press. Barker hangs on to it, shakes his head. Feels like he's managed to move his elbow to the back and he's coming round for his own transition. Here comes the tricep. And it's Barker with the win. The Englishman gets his nose in front. Look at the hand positioning. Moves up and across the palm. 
of Nenjes moves around with his tricep. Crunch down and comes him into the bar. And it's an aggressive roar into the face of Maynard Nenjes from that man. Wise grip Andy Barker. Rubbing the collateral ligaments on the inside Ooh. of that elbow. Maybe some damage done. It's called the collateral ligament. It's funny because collateral damage in this match will be so important. And uh, Maynard Nenches, his arm being worked okay, on by his brother, needs an answer to that top roll. Barker has the, found that yeah, is his so, key yeah. to victory. Show Randy, please. And he will exploit okay. that. A little bit of risk there, please. All afternoon. Don't move the. Unless the Go! Dutchman can find a way to block it. Speed is a weapon, and Nenches was not hanging about there. But Barker, very relaxed look upon his face. The experience a weapon. Don't move. Go! Standing his hand up high in that strap, and he gains the hand control. Nenches with an enormous drive now comes in with the tricep. But Barker is waiting for the breath. Watch for the counter from the Englishman. If a breath comes from the man from the Netherlands, he will be punished. He took one there. And Barker adjusts. Winner. His next one will be a big drive. There it is. There's the win for Barker. And Andy Barker is starting to develop his range of techniques, the breathing style in his top roll defence there. The first breath, he collected his hand. The second breath, he did I made him pay the with the, the top roll. Uh, his wrist wasn't up to it, so uh, I, I punished him with a top roll on a few occasions. Andy Barker moving through the gears as this match progresses. And it's taking a toll on a heavily sweating Maynard Nenjes. Barker elevates his arm, tries to uh, get the lactic acid and blood out of there and just check your hairs right. Always an important factor for Andy Barker. Wants to look good while he's winning. Go! Big drive from Nenches, but he sacrificed that hand and wrist again. Barker slots inside. And for a tall, rangy character, Andy Barker has plenty of power in the hook. He will control the hand. There's the big squeeze, there's the pin, and he looks to his teammates in the crowd as though it's a walk in the park. Look at that from Barker. Total hand and wrist control. Sweeps to the side. There's the pin, and Andy Barker is taking over here at the Trafford Centre. Tremendous win. Barker into the hook, looking powerful. Chagen just seems to be running out of endurance, sweating more and more heavily as the matches progress. And the hand and wrist is being sacrificed. He needs something and he needs it now, even if it's just for pride, Nenches. What happened to the tricep press? There it is. Just as I say, it drives in with the tricep press. That's what the Dutchman have been looking for. And what a way for him to finish the match. He gets some pride back and he enjoyed that one.